things need to happen and they might not always be good, but it always turns out to help us become better humans. I am very appreciated. I'm a very appreciated. Sasha's 2021 and we still not making sense. Oh, gosh. Hey you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel and happy, happy, happy new year. We are in 2021 guys, which is crazy. I feel like each year that we say a new year number, like 2021, I'm like, what? It's so crazy, but we are in the new year. I'm super excited. So. In today's video, we're gonna go ahead and talk about a couple things. We're gonna talk about if you should set goals in 2021. We're gonna talk about my intentions. Um, and I won't be sharing my goals on YouTube this year, but I will be sharing, can't talk, it's been a minute. It's been a minute, it's been a minute. It's, it's been a minute. Um, I will be sharing my word of the year, or in this case, two. I chose two words, and I'll be telling you guys why I chose those two words. Yeah, so we're gonna talk about that. So, um, before we jump into the video, don't forget, guys, to subscribe to my channel. Same thing, new year, but same thing. Join the family, hit that red button, it's free and then turn on your notifications i will be uploading i have a new upload schedule now guys i'm gonna be uploading every saturday at 9 30 a.m um i'm plan i'm hoping that this works out better for me to be consistent in uploading oh also follow me on my social media it'll be linked down below or somewhere on the screen so you guys can go follow me it's simply sasha 414 um i have a brand new reel on there and i'm super excited to be um, putting out content on there also so without further ado we're gonna go ahead and jump right into the video okay so for the first question should I set goals in 2021? My answer to that question is yes. Um, I know some people don't like to set goals because they think it's like a thing, you're just setting yourself up for failure or I don't know if some people um, are a little hesitant. I was a little hesitant to um, set goals because of last year, but setting goals helps you uh, like wanna strive towards something. When you set goals, you're working towards something. And I think that's a great thing. Just because last year wasn't the best year for most of us or all of us, um, it did help me in a way as in growth in different areas of my life that I probably wouldn't have grown in if you know a lot of things didn't happen last year. So sometimes things need to happen and they might not always be good, but it always turns out to help us become better humans and I'm very appreciative of that and the lessons that I've learned of last year and I plan to take them into this year and glow up as in like mentally and physically and emotionally and things like that you know level up but um yeah I think you should definitely set goals it's always good to have something that you're working towards or striving for whether that be um, a physical or a mental or something that just um, helps you grow. Um, I think it's important. So yes, definitely set goals. It's set them basically is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> if you don't want to, then that's fine. But, um, I think you should, or at least work on some work, set a goal that is something like personal, like, um, you know, getting closer to God or, um, working on something about yourself basically to better, if that makes sense. All right. I'm going to go on. Cause now I think I'm like, uh, rambling and I don't want to ramble this this video okay this was new to me um last year I found out last year from my friend Katie shout out to Katie that people pick words basically I, I think it's kind of like an intention thing um I feel like it's more like a goal too like people pick a word for the year that they want to focus on or whatever I chose two words this year so my first word I want to share with you guys is patience I realized that during quarantine, I don't have any. Now, I do have patience with like children and certain things, but when it comes to myself and maybe sometimes loved ones, I don't have patience. I really don't. And I really, really wanna work on it. It's like really bad. Like as in, 
I don't have patience as in like I need to kind of relax when I'm in the middle of doing something or a task or I need to relax and understand that things take time and like new skills or things like that like a lot of times I just want to get whatever I'm doing like this and it doesn't work like that Sasha it don't so um, yeah that's one of the things I would like to work on I feel like I'm always trying to rush to the next thing and plan the next thing before I'm enjoying the thing right now that I was want planning for beforehand if that makes sense so I'm like oh I want to do that and then when I get there I'm not enjoying that I'm trying to move on to the next that hopefully that made sense but yeah I really want to work on my patience it's funny because when I'm recording this which is January 1st new year I literally said this morning I was like oh I'm gonna try lashes and then I was like never mind I don't have the patience for that and I'm like Sasha your word is patience you need to work on it girl you need to work on it but um yeah so that is my word well one of my words my second word which I really like and I'm really excited for is bold I know right I want to be more confident in my choices in my views and in my creative in my creative creativity um, I don't want to be afraid to try something new I don't want to hold back in trying something new I want to be okay with making mistakes and knowing that making those mistakes will essentially make me into a better person if I keep looking off to the side I have some notes so I don't get like sidetrack in my head spin but um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to trying to just um, step out my comfort zone a little more, be more open, be more vocal, be just more proud in me and who I am. And um, yeah, nobody gonna stop me. Nobody gonna silence me. So yeah, guys, those are my two words for the year. I highly suggest trying this out. Uh, especially if you don't really like doing goals um, I think it's really cool to pick a word or two like me being dramatic being extra um, or pick a, a word or two that it's kind of like a goal because you're striving to practice towards something you know attain that goal but yeah I think it's a really cool concept and uh, I liked it last year don't remember my uh, word last year because after March everything kind of just everything kind of just went if you know what I mean so um <laughs> yeah yeah we're not gonna talk about last year anymore but anyways yeah I don't remember my word and I didn't really stick to it which is understandable but um yeah all right guys so that is the end of the video I hope you guys enjoyed it I hope it was helpful or a little bit motivational to like um, make some goals or pick a word or just keep your views the same it's fine I get it um but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and make sure you guys stay safe I hope you had a great New Year's and I will see you guys on my next video which is next Saturday and it's gonna be a plan with me video and yeah love you guys so much and I'll see you next time this is <laughs>